help me, boys and girls. I've been blind. Ah, there you go. Much better. But yes, welcome back to the Let's Play for Silent Hill. Where we last left Harry hanging out in a pool hall. You know, as he's wont to do, apparently. Stealing Kaufman shit. Got to reset it. For a lot of dodgy bondage porn, apparently. And also a key of some sort. But no. The receipt... Actually, I don't know what the receipt is actually for in the end. I can't remember off the top of my head. The key is to door number three of the motel. Which is where Kaufman was staying for some reason or other. Alright, the Indian... Ah, that's, that's a clue as to where we go next. The Indian runner. Need to pick up goodies from over that way. Superb. Now, again, all of this is, you know, sub-quest type stuff. You don't have to do any of this in order to progress with the game. But if you don't, uh, you will not get the best ending. Because you need Kaufman to both be alive and willing and able to help you at the end of the game in order to get the best ending. You also require one of the other secondary characters to not be dead. Which is why you need to collect a sample of that red liquid that uh, Kaufman and his cronies have been developing. Right. If the game will load, we shall march ever bravely onward. Or perhaps not bravely, but we shall march onward. Let's see, Indian runners closest, I think. So, we shall turn ourselves around and go check it out. Here we go. <laughs> nope, that was a dead end. That's a great start, Lazaro. Well done. And I have noticed, you know, that when I play this, how dark the resolution and what comes out for the videos. No matter what alterations I make. You know, I consider correcting it, but it actually adds a, uh, a nice air of fear to the whole thing and claustrophobia. Which in this particular case is a good thing. Yeah, ah, there we go. Shit! Shit, 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 shit. Fuck, ran up a corner, shit. Run away, quick. Ah, fuck. Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Ah, I knew I was going to outrun them the whole time. Well, I wasn't scared. Now, a few monsters with my not horrifically mauling me while I stand here and solve a padlock. Much appreciated. Very polite monsters, obviously. Actually, come to think of it, what game was I playing recently? A horror title. Where the enemies don't stop attacking you while you solve puzzles. I cannot remember. Oh, probably not important for now. Ooh, rifle bullets. Anything? Nope, nothing else in here? Fine. I'll grab these rifle bullets, though. Mine! Nice one. Health drink. Superb. August 20th, he came by, handed over the package that woman left here. Showed up at Norman's, too. My god. More people writing down their bi diabolical schemes for no particular reason. Hmm. Can I not open the safe? Push the wrong damn button, that didn't help. Nope, I can't use the key to open the safe. Right, okay. Well, whatever then. I'll figure this out later. In the meantime, where's the motel from here? Ah, straight down the road. Awesome. That should work out nicely. Well, for me at least, anyway. Only a short jaunt into- SHIT! Stop attacking me, you freaks. Ah. Don't know why, but actually consciously cut myself off from swearing there. Oh well. Who knows, perhaps I'm growing as a person. <laughs> anyway. Uh, let's see. Yeah, a bit further down the road. Shit. Ah, there's the door, but it's locked. Shit, fuck. God damn it, why do I keep getting hit by those damn things? Shit. Get off my crotch. Stupid man ape monster. Take some beats. Shit. Sledgehammer to the arse. I'll teach you a lesson. A lesson you won't soon forget. At least, you know, you wouldn't if I hadn't killed you. Hmm. 
it's locked. My god. That's number two. We don't want number two. We want number three. Awesome. Let's check it out. Suspicious looking cabinet. Yeah, well, that's pretty obvious, let's face it. Right, let's grab a goodie and be out of here. You. What? What do you mean you can't? Well, smash it open then, Harry. See, so you can break up some crappy floorboard, surely. Or you're not willing to because it's private property. Okay, so how do I get it then? Nope. Really, nobody in the shower. Well done, Harry, well done. So how do I... Is there a coat hanger I can pick up and fish them out, or...? Right. Okay. This is... Right. Hmm. This is bullshit. Jeez, there's gotta be something here somewhere. Sometime today would be nice? No. Okay. Okay. Um... Okay, so what have I missed then? Clearly I've missed something. Right. Uh, okay, you know what folks? I'm gonna go figure this out and I shall see you all in a moment. Okay, so it turns out that <laughs> basically I cocked up rather horrifically. If you go to the Indian runner there's actually a combination for that safe, and inside it you can get a bunch of stuff you need. You can also get a magnet, which is, you know, very helpful. Uh, you get that from the office of this place. The combination for getting into the office, you get, again, from the Indian runner. It's 0882, I think, something like that. Can't remember off the top of my head. But yeah. Now, what goodies are there in the office? Save point. It's always nice. Excellent, excellent. Now, what else is around here? That door's locked. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Try again, Harry. Try again. Now, there should be a garage somewhere around here. Um... No, that's not it. Turn around, turn around, turn around. <sighs> Fuck, that's not doing my heart any good. Ah, here we go. A motorcycle. We can ride to freedom in style. After we, you know, picked up some ammo. An old motorcycle. Alright, it's rusted and shitty and won't work. That's great. But someone's been stuffing stuff inside the gas tank. Gas tank, even. Right, let's find out what's in there. Vials full of blood. Apparently this was Dracula's motorcycle. No, it's the same weird red liquid that we found in the hospital. Except a full jar of it this time. Give me that. Fuck off. What is this? Find us keepers. That's none of your business. Dude, I saved your life. Instead of messing with that, how about coming up with a way to get out of here? How about I shoot you in the face? You shouldn't be hanging around here goofing off. Shoot him, Harry. What do you think you're doing? Shoot him now. You want to shoot him. him. Get out of here. Okay, take it easy. Fuck your door, Matt Harry. Unless you want to die, keep your mind on business. Unless you want to die, get out of my business. Pop a cap in your ass. Yeah, I'm not really sure why they set it up like that. That is, you know, the side quest complete. But they set it up in such a fashion as to make you think you have, as Harry said, just horrifically wasted what little time you have left. But trust me, you haven't. Not really, anyway. Well, nope. Get away from me, you freak! Where am I going? Alright, swing it right. Actually, there should be a diner around here somewhere. I think I can grab extra supplies out of. 
Or at least from nearby it anyway. Uh it's gonna be on the right hand side of the road though, isn't it? Yeah, it doesn't actually show up on the map. Give it a try. Now yeah, where is it? Could be along here somewhere. Ah there we go. Uh no. Right. For some reason they give that uh, an interactable door. But you can't go in there. I always thought it was a bit of a weird choice personally. Well, whatever. Whatever I guess. Mosey it right along and get the hell out of here. Any creepy noises going on all of a sudden? Some metal shrieking and twisting noises, that's not very nice. What are you planning, game? What's this? Uh, siren to Oh my god, I'm not sure what's more terrifying. Does your hell mode or Harry's horrendous, horrendous voice acting? I mean seriously, how do you even direct or something that bad? Do you go, your character is being shifted into a nightmarish hell dimension. The world is shifting and shaking around him. I want you to act as if you've just discovered that the tip you were planning to spend is actually going to be slightly more expensive. Oh! Ridiculous. Right, I need to get to the lighthouse, don't I? So it's going to be up this road and left as soon as possible. I think. Oh, okay. I think I can go via the docks. I mean, I'm not entirely certain, but I think I can. Uh, or not. Right, okay. So I can't go that way. I need to find a different way of doing this. My sweet. Fuck! Get off my crotch! How many times do I have to tell you people? I give you beats now. Fuck! Dodge out the way. Because Harry's having a very slow animation day. Why do I keep getting a white line flash across my screen as well? That's irritating and weird. Not in the good way. Alright, let's go straight to the end. There's probably goodies hidden up that other alcove, but I can't bother to go get them. Not when there are monstrosity is about. Come on, 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 come on. Come on, Harry, run! Flee! Escape! Uh left, is that it? Past the weird bush shelter look looking thing. Uh so they got a lot of Fucking hell that was close. Got a lot of benches out here, haven't they? Apparently a lot of people like to sit here and watch the sea. Actually then again, this was a tourist town, wasn't it? Don't know if any of you have ever been to like Cornwall or Blackpool or whatnot. They tend to do a lot of that sort of business in seaside towns. People seem to like to sit there and watch the sea. Usually while eating ice cream. I could go for ice cream right now. Hmm. Coffee ice cream. Mm. No, coffee and caramel swirl, that's... That's where the money's at. Ah, so I'm getting distracted again. Seems to be talking about food and drink a lot during this LP, don't I? I think it's because stress and fear makes me hungry. Weird. Fuck! Get away, get away! Where are you going? You can't go this way, this is where I'm going. Find your own route, stupid demon dog. It's all gone silent again. And there's an emancipated corpse up there, of course there is. Delightful. Right. 